Hey, I'm Run Creeper Run. That's a beautiful sunset. And I'm just about to show you something awesome. See this? You know, this looks just like a ordinary, boring stone wall. You know, nothing nothing very uh, suspicious about it. Apart maybe for the glowstone, but... You know, that stuff's everywhere in the overworld. <gasps> What's this? A secret passage to the other side of the wall. But, point is... You would obviously have yourself a room here. And I'm just about to teach you how to build this. Pretty simple. First, you need a whole bunch of what you're going to build out of. I'm going to build it out of stone. Just because it's uh, plain. And that's what you normally find in caves. You will need eight pieces of redstone. Four repeaters. A lever. Twelve sticky pistons. And, if you would like the uh, more complicated things, you will need three redstone torches and, uh, let's see, four stone pressure plates with a little bit of extra redstone. Now, what you do first is you make a two by two square right there. Then you leave a space on each side and place another two by two square. Just like that. It should look exactly like that. Now, you build your wall. You build a roof right on top of it, just like this. And you're going pretty fast. You place repeaters right here, which will be right on top of where there's no piston right at the space. And four redstone right in the middle. Now, don't forget that in the back right here, where you'll see these back right here, you gotta turn these repeaters onto a four tick delay. Just right there on max. After this, you place redstone on each side. Then you go on the side and you place two blocks just like that. You could have it like that, or you could have it like that. But I personally prefer it like this as it is easier to hide the redstone later. Place a repeater right there. You have to remember to do that, otherwise it will not work. Place your two redstone right there. Come on over here, do the same thing. And um, you're done. If you don't like complicated things, you, know, you just push that lever right there, and it will open. If I could hit the lever. I'm very talented at hitting lever. Um, let's see, right there. It's the perfect opening. It's the perfect size to uh, you know accommodate any house you want. Flip it, and it closes right again. Now, if you want, if you don't want a lever, you just you want your uh, door to be automatic. You simply. Add two blocks right here, an overhang right here, place a torch right here in this corner. You then place a block directly below it, you place a torch on top of that block. After this, you go down to two, place a torch right there, right below it, so now this top one is on. You will then connect the redstone to your little contraption right here. And it will stay closed permanently until you do this. Dig over to where you're at the entrance. Dig yourself out of space. Which is nice because you'll have to remove it anyway to uh, put your natural flooring. And you just line the bottom right here with redstone. And actually, if you're cheap and you just want to save some redstone, instead of doing it like this, you can just do this. Or put that right there. One line. Work the same. Now, cover this up. Oops. Place your pressure plates right here. There we go. Let me place more floor right here. And just walk straight through. 
to the side as well. And there you go. You got yourself a door. You can just place on over here, cover it up, and there you go. You got to have it all done, and uh, this could be your cave entrance. And some of you, my witty viewers, may have noticed this thing over here. You may be asking what it is. Well, when an animal, I won't bore you with trying to get an animal in here. When an animal steps in here, walks over these pressure plates, and that animal is in turn trapped. This is a very convenient way to uh, herd, herd your animals, seeing as how this really sucks to do. And you even got yourself a release tab right here. And you just turn it back on, you can't get out. Now, if this video gets 10 likes, I will post a video showing you how to make this. So, that's all. This is Run Creeper Run signing off. And all I want from you guys is to stay zesty. Goodbye.